Ed. I'm Isaac Dill, and I plan on being a social video producer. First off, we got education requirements. You're going to need your high school diploma and a college degree. Most people get a bachelor's. There's not really a specific major, but I plan on going into sports management and getting placed under like a sports organization working for them. And experience and connections, that's also important to have to help you get placed in a job that you want to be placed in. Uh, how's the pay? Uh, Salary is about 64600 uh, to 83,400 monthly about 7,000 and can range to 8,000 weekly it's about 1,800 benefits you got health insurance you're gonna have like your dental care all the basic stuff uh, they also give you paid holidays and then retirement accounts like 401k you also get paid vacation which is nice uh, some of the leading some of the leading companies that offer this is like NFL, Leo Events, uh, NASCAR, MLB, Tenga. Uh, work hours, a work e work week can extend past 40 hours. Uh, work shifts tend to range from 8 to 12 hours, and then they do offer overtime. Employment locations, you can be. I tend to attend uh, UTC. I've already been accepted. You can uh, have like, as you're getting your degree, they'll place you like in internships. Uh, NFL, Clayton Holmes, Daily Wire, Georgia Pacific, and Scholastic. Uh, path, what is needed. This is kind of the path I hope to take. Uh, acquire a degree in sports management, like I mentioned before. Uh, Complete internships with the sports uh, sport organizations uh, that UTC has, uh, and then graduate and be placed in a job that I desire. How will a career portfolio help? It's going to provide information or confirmation that you are qualified to perform the task provided. It's also going to provide your resume and like all the awards I've achieved throughout my academic career. And then my budget, my net, my monthly net income is going to be around 580. Um, my fixed income is going to be around $270 and then controllables around 590. And that leaves me with about $260 in the negative. Why I chose this career, my passion for sports, and I'm not really getting an opportunity to continue my sports career at the collegiate level, so I want to find a way like, to stay around that. So I felt this is like a good way to stay around it. Uh, I enjoy working with social media. It has good pay, excellent benefits, and then TikTok. I was actually scrolling through TikTok one day, and a video popped up, and it was this girl talking about how she became a social video producer for like, she's actually working for the 49ers, which is an NFL team. And she took the same uh, major that I plan on taking at UTC, so I thought that was cool. And then a tour at ETSU, I went on a tour there, and I actually got to talk to like that department they have there, the sports management pro uh, sports management program. And they told me that they could place me in a job like at a Division One school, so that was cool. And then, that, thank you. Is there any questions? <laughs> Have you thought about a backup plan? Well, my backup plan is probably join the military, Air Force, something like that. Any more questions? You know that's going to require cutting your hair, right? <laughs> <laughs>